sure how much of this I've shown before, but this is the traverser table we put together. And it has that uh, red alignment pin for each of the six tracks. It's got a renumbered pannier that's now 6430 on the tracks. Um, I've also finished doing all of the, um, the grass for the, uh, the tunnel between Berwyn and um, Deeside Halt. Um, I did do uh, static grass this time, which I thought was kind of fun. Um, went with um, Mr. Dan's recommendation and got um, a uh, static grass from Aussie Scenics. Static grass looks much better uh, as you're coming through the pass of the road. I started to kind of get the hang of it as we were going. Um, also started to get the riverbed for the D River. Um, all laid. It goes all the way around the back to the island just by the King's Bridge at uh, Berwyn Station. Uh, I've also wired up the repeater. Um, it's a little bit difficult to get it to say RA in uh, the right gauge, but um, it came out a little large, otherwise it looks okay. It's made from a modified uh, dapple signal. Uh, when I was wiring up my first one, um, I think we switched two of the wires and uh, ended up burning out the motor. So I uh, thought I'd make use of the light, so uh, it became this uh, repeater signal. Chain Bridge Hotel has come on now. It actually does have a chain bridge. Um, again, then the riverbed. Um, Showing some of the details at Berwyn Station. We even have the, uh, the bird feeder. And then continue past uh, Berwyn. There's a future site of the farm right there, the other part of the riverbed. Bridge has come on quite a bit, it's done the uh, stonework to it now. We've also painstakingly stuck matchsticks in between each one of the tracks to get the wood effect. Um, and pinch fell in shed. And then other than that, not much has changed. We've got a couple of the um, buildings built. Um, not sure if I'd shown the engine shed before. The engine shed is designed such that we lift it up. And the front door's taken out if uh, you want to run trains in and out of it. Otherwise, the front doors stay in for uh, aesthetic effects. Not much has changed at Langothan other than the, the buildings we've put up. Um, Undertakers is coming along just there. Um, points and tr uh, uh, signals are all wired now. Um, we used a controller um, to power the um, points separately. I wanted to get a nice slow effect as they switched. As you can see, it's just a really nice gradual change other than a, uh, a very abrupt uh, switch. So I really liked how that came out. And then we've got all of our DCC concept point levers. Um, all numbered per the um, Langothan station diagram. Um, so yeah, it's really coming along.